Yo, yo, what's up everybody? Hope everyone's doing well. Today we're gonna talk a little bit about software and programming. Everything I'm gonna talk about in this video is related to your mindset. I'm not gonna talk over any code, anything with any particular language. I just wanna show you guys that attitude and your mind make a huge, huge difference when it comes to programming. If you're considering doing software at a company or you're already a professional developer, hope this video can help you and let's do it, all right? Number one is to hold your ego. There's a 90% chance at a job you're gonna be programming with other people. One of the hardest parts of software development is working effectively and productively with other people. It's really, really, really rare to work solo on any project if you're at a company. So my first point is to really leave your ego at the door. There's never ever really a good reason to really push for a fancy programming technique that you think might be right but doesn't jive well with other people. Disregarding patterns and doing things your own way a lot of the time just kills productivity. Create, follow, and design patterns with the rest of the team so you can follow them together. The second point that I wanna make is to always leave the code cleaner than how you found it. The thing about crappy code is that no one really wants to fix it, so the code just gets more and more crappy. And it's... If you see something, just fix it. Even if it's really, really small, it's just a typo in the comment or the variable is named a little weird, just clean it up right there. If everyone collectively leaves the code cleaner than how they found it, it just slowly becomes more and more awesome. This point is really up to you. When you see something, just fix it, don't let it rot, and make the code slowly and slowly better. My third and last point is that rewriting an application is almost always the wrong choice. Unless the program has really, 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 really gone to shit, you probably shouldn't rewrite it. The ability to work with old or legacy code is just part of programming. It's your responsibility of dealing with other people's code, reading it, and improving it for the future. So if you think rewriting something is gonna make it better, I can almost tell you with 100% certainty that it's not gonna do anything. There's something really, really subtle with decision-making when it comes to programming. If you're starting a brand new project today and you make decisions X, Y, and Z to implement it, you'll realize that in one or two years, when you look back on those decisions, X, Y, and Z, they'll seem like those weren't the right decisions at all. Every single decision that you make in programming, you can always use hindsight and say, back then, I could have chose something more optimal. So the only time where you should write something completely from scratch, if it's a brand new idea, a brand new service, or if it's really, really gone down the tubes. For the 95% of the time, when you don't write something completely new, it's your responsibility as a programmer to add and improve that. Rewriting code for the sake of rewriting it and just making it better just never works and it usually just reflects pure laziness. All right guys, so those were three quick points that I had to improve your mindset as a programmer and hopefully be more effective. Always remember, there's a lot that goes into being a really effective engineer besides just being really good at pure coding. Just get your mind in the right place and you're gonna be awesome, just killing it. Okay, so just wrapping up the video there. Hopefully it's pretty short. I'm gonna to try to stick to my three or four minute rule and see you guys next time, all right? Leave me a comment and see you soon.